space. Hey guys, this is Jeff with Jeff's Custom RC, and today we are at the field out here at the Kinston Aero Modelers Club in Kinston, North Carolina, where we will be having our fly-in this coming weekend for the Big Bird Warbird Classics. And we're gonna have a great time, guys. And this is going to be one of our giveaways. This is from Hobby King. This is the Durafly 1100 millimeter Spitfire, guys. This plane is pretty awesome. Uh, it does have lights, nice retracts. Get in on those, Wayne. Mm, good you stuff. have a nice three blade prop here, guys. Really nice detailing on this plane as well. Uh, if you guys saw the live show last uh, Tuesday night, Wayne and I put this plane together roughly and put some of the decals on it. And uh, pretty easy build, a couple of screws, no gluing except for your plastic bits on the plane. Um, we'll open up the hatch and show you guys the battery placement. This is a 4S 2200 all the way forward for the perfect CG, the sweet spot. And, um, yeah, I mean, so we're going to get it up in the air and see what we got from this and uh, hopefully get you guys a great video. And this will be our raffle, one of them this weekend, guys. We got a lot of things we're giving away, and this will be given away in uh, our raffle this weekend. So if you're around and can get out here, buy some tickets, and uh, hopefully you'll win this nice plane. So let's get to it. Very high rates right now. I will be switching to mid rates for takeoff typical taxi of this airplane I would taxi if you're going to I would taxi this airplane in high rates with full up elevator to pin that tail down so you don't nose over and uh, as with any Spitfire always be on the right rudder once you get up on the mains for steering capabilities and uh, today we've got just a slight headwind quartering uh, what would you say, 5 to 10 maybe variable? Uh, 5.9. Okay, all right, there you go. So uh, without further ado, guys, let's hit it up and see what we got. Absolutely. Anything for the shot. <clears throat> oh, that's sexy right there. Oh yeah. And I'm gonna do a no flat takeoff today since this is a maiden and we're not really sure how this is gonna end the thing. So uh yeah, that's it. Beautiful. Okay, I'm ready. Ready to go. Ready. Beautiful. Just like you've been flying a hundred flights. Bring back towards it, slow and easy. I will if I can find you. Oh, there you are. There you go. Like that light. Remaining three minutes. Got good power. Yeah, full throttle. Coming around. Half cubic. 
can't smoke a Cuban while you're flying a Spitfire. <laughs> Need to brighten up screen next time. Looks good. I like it. Got a five minute timer set with this airplane right now, guys. We're not killing it, just trying to keep it closed so that we can get it pretty much trimmed in. Everything seems to be locked right now. Like I said, this is with no gyro in this airplane. Wow. Is that looking good for you, Wayne? Looks great. So good, I couldn't see it. All right, we got two minutes. We're going to try some gear down. So I'm going to come back towards you and put the gear down so you can kind of get a good shot of that. He's not on a delay. You're getting ready to come in now. Nice. Let's see. I don't Okay, not too much tendency with anything, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna land this airplane as well with no flaps and land from left to right just to kind of approach, see what we have going on here, just kind of see what we think. And low rates again, guys, so I'm gonna slow her down a little bit. I gotta fly the plane in. Nice. And uh, now I'm going to switch to high rates for my taxi back. High rates. Tin the tail with full down elevator. Start. Or full up elevator down on your stick rather. And just a slow nice taxi back. We just had our field roll last weekend, guys, and we can definitely tell it. Special shout out to Robert and Mr. Bruce for that. Um, Sounds good, too. Man, it's, that thing was just flawless. Do we have to give it away? <laughs> you need to win it, Wayne. I need something. I don't get anything around here. I don't even get a drink. Right, I'm going to put a throttle cut on it, guys, and we're going to take it over to the table and uh, see what we're looking like. We have uh, right at five minutes, so we're going to check it and see where our sales are. But other than that, guys, flawless. Um, I'm used to a gyro. I love a gyro. This plane, I do not have one in it, so you saw how well it flew. Yeah, that was impressive. Yeah, very impressive. Uh, Liftoff was phenomenal. Could not complain a bit with that. Landing was flawless. Uh, no tip over tendency nope. on this for me. Um, so yeah, I, I'm, I'm very pleased. So let's get it up to the table and see where we're at. Sweet. As far as our uh, battery goes and uh, get it out of the sun. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're here at the table. We're going to check the pack. Let me grab my checker, Wayne, and uh, we'll figure out what we got going on here. Let's see. Over here. Oh, smart checker from uh, Spectrum here, guys. And um, like I said, this was a pretty much right at a five minute flight. And, guys, as I said, you can see where this battery is all the way forward. It's touching the um, back of the motor. Fireball. Uh, yeah. So. And uh, everything was good there. Um, once I got it dialed in, everything was great. So let's uh, get in on this thing here, Wayne, and we'll see what we got here. Gosh, look at that. That's incredible, guys. We could have probably gotten, what do you think, another minute and a half? Another five minutes away, you're flying. <laughs> flying Miss Daisy All here. you gotta do is take that uh, handicap placard off and you can start exactly. flying Exactly. So guys, that's it. I mean, I can't think of anything else better to say about this airplane. Uh, truthfully, I mean, you've got lights on this airplane. Um, we could see those really good coming down the runway. Yeah, I could. Um, and easy build, uh, the wing screws right on. So if you did need to take the wing off, it's four screws. Um, everything screws on back here. The only gluing on this airplane are the plastic parts here, your antenna, and also your mirror. Other than that, guys, that's it. Um, no more glue and uh, this plane like i said we talk about on just custom rc guys here how you can transport planes easier so as i said if you needed to take this plane apart to transport it 
these four screws holding the wings. You unplug your elevator and your uh, rudder leads. And uh, we got jets flying over here today. Imagine that, right? Oh yeah, what's that, a 16? or No, that looks like a Mirage. All I know is it's... Very nice. So see, we give you the real stuff here too, guys, right? That's right. But uh, yeah, I mean, Hobby King and Durafly have knocked this one out of the park, guys. Great flyer, fun flyer. Have zero complaints. I mean, you guys saw it here first. That was the first official flight. I just got all the decals finished on it this morning. CG'd it according to the manual. Everything was spot on. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. And I would say good luck to the lucky winner of this airplane coming up this Saturday at the Big Bird Warbird Classic here in Kinston, North Carolina. And tell them the temperatures. Tell them the temperatures. Oh, yeah. Friday, the high here, guys, is supposed to be 74 degrees. Yes. Time. Should be probably 48. And Saturday morning, I'm guessing what, weighing 50 maybe? I don't know, but you're cooking. So, uh, hey, we're going to have some good food, guys. So get out here if you can. Bring your Big Birds and any Warbird will fly, guys. It can be this size or bigger. So definitely get out. Enjoy some good, fun food, fellowship, and fly in all the Fs in there, guys. And, not all the uh, well not all the f's but <laughs> unless you bring your camper well you know that's you know? up to you so you know if the campers are rocking you know what i'm saying uh -uh. um uh -uh. anyway guys thanks for watching i'm jeff wayne's on the camera here guys doing a great job and we appreciate you watching and we will see you next time right here at jeff's custom rc take care and with that, guys, I'd like to thank everyone for watching. I hope you'll consider liking and subscribing as well as leaving a comment. We like to hear what you think. And, guys, we hope to see you this coming Saturday for our Big Bird Warbird Classic in Kinston, North Carolina at the Kinston Aero Modelers Club. I'd also like to thank Durafly and Hobby King for this amazing Spitfire that we'll be giving away at our raffle, along with Hangar 18 in Cary, North Carolina, a Horizon Hobby dealer. I'd like to thank ZoomRC.net. RTL Fasteners, and 5280RC, home of the True Fire Burner for all of your jets, guys, from 50 millimeter up to 105 millimeter. Larry will take good care of you. Thanks again, guys. Please come fly with us. It should be a great day, big event, and I think you'll enjoy what you see. As always, I'm Jeff. Thanks for watching Jeff's Custom RC.